Good morning, I'm Rena Nainen. And I'm Kendra Gibson with the top stories on this Friday, March 4th, starting with the latest Republican presidential debate. Even though uh, it had only four candidates on stage, the event was noisier than all of the previous ones as it devolved into name calling and vulgar talk of body parts. Donald Trump spending most of his time answering to attacks by Ted Cruz and Marco Rubio. However, all remaining candidates said they would support Trump as the GOP nominee. And putting an end to months of speculation, President Obama says he will be sticking around Washington once his term is over. The president says he wants daughter Sasha to be able to finish high school without having to transfer in the middle of the year. The president's older daughter, Malia, attends college this fall. Lawmakers in California are once again considering raising the smoking age to 21. The state Senate expected to take up a bill. The assembly has already passed it. Republican lawmakers oppose it, saying they say those who are old enough to join the military and get married should be able to smoke if they want to. Some veterans groups oppose the ban for the same reason. And regardless of your age, don't think about smoking in this bathroom. Plane maker Boeing is working on an almost completely touchless bathroom. It also self-cleans thanks to the use of ultraviolet light, which the company says disinfects everything. They say the light kills nearly 100% of all germs. No word on when the system could debut in Boeing planes. Don't you think we need this in kindergarten and preschool classrooms across America? Are you kidding? We need it around the studios. And the newsroom. You're right. <laughs> yeah, You're right. great. It's the best. Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Kendis Gibson. And I'm Rena Nine, and thanks so much for watching.